Hi, Yarnabies. How are you today? Uh, I'm testing out a new mic that I got. <laughs> so I'm kind of hoping that it's going to work out. Um, so I got my first Timu order in today. And I thought I would open it with you guys. Now this is... Oh! This is an order for the shop. Um, I'm, I'm, I've been watching other YouTubers uh, from the Yarny community that has been getting these team orders. And so far, it seems to be that they're good reviews. So I thought, well, okay, I'm just going to try it and see what happens. So I thought maybe I'd open it with you. You guys will see, get the first, first C. Uh, I also got a Amazon order. I've been waiting for these. Uh, I was telling you guys that I was doing some amigurumi and I ran out of eyes. So, oh, it's in a different second bag. Um, so I thought, well, okay, I'm going to try and buy some eyes from them and see what happens. Holy Hannah. What the heck? I was kind of hoping it was going to be in a case, but apparently not. Um, okay, well, that's kind of cool. They came like this with the cover over them. To protect the eyes that's nice um the base of them is really thick but they also have whoops hmm. these are not what i thought they were going to be they're flat which means when you put these in the eyes are going to be sticking out i thought they were going to be the cups that cup over top. Well, I guess we'll have to let's try them out and try and see how they how they are. Oh, they're all different sizes. Oh, there's some small ones and some big ones. Oh, I'm gonna have to go through all of these and uh, put them in different. I've got a a case here that I can put them in, but they're all different sizes. Got the small ones. And then you've got all your different colors here. Hmm. Okay, well, that's gonna be a pain in the neck. Because now I gotta go through them all and uh, sort them all out. But we'll try them, see how they are. Okay, let's open up this Timu and uh, Fingers crossed. Okay, so I got it open. <laughs> um, I got some t-shirts for the shop uh, that I thought were going to be really kind of cool. I like how they come in these plastic bags with the zipper. Really, Bailey? We're doing that. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, you're going to hear some squeaking from Bailey. Um, oh, these are these are actually nice shirts. Okay, they're good, nice material. That's impressive. Hmm, okay then. So here's the first shirt. Make sure I'm not running over my dog. I don't know if you're going to be able to read this. Can you read that? Really? Really? <laughs> it says... I don't have ducks in a row. I have squirrels and they're everywhere. <laughs> so I thought that was going to be really cute for the shop. And I believe I got them up to three or four X. So, so I'm really impressed with that material. I really like that. Um, so I know I got a bunch of those. That's another one. Uh, that's another one. These ones. I've been telling everybody in the shop about these ones. 
because I just thought they were so accurate. <laughs> um, because it's they're totally me. They're nice material too. Huh. Okay. Yay. <laughs> Here we go. Can you read that? It says, don't follow me, or don't follow in my footsteps. I run into walls. <laughs> I thought that was pretty accurate. So the material is really soft. It's really nice. I can kind of see through it a little bit. Um, but because of the color, I don't think it's going to be that bad. I've come to the conclusion that I'm not going to be buying white clothes just in case the material is really thin. I don't want to um, be disappointed with, uh, with any see-through stuff, right? That's the worst thing. I just can't stand that when... Um, when you buy something and it's so, it's such a thin material that it, you can just see right through it. it drives me crazy okay um so i got a bunch of those and i think i got those up to a three or four up too uh, okay now this one I got for men, um, and I thought it was pretty accurate for George. Oh, Bailey. Whew. Oh, Bailey's stinking me out. Okay. Again, material is extremely soft. Material is a little bit thinner, but nothing major. And I figured that was pretty accurate for George. <laughs> and for most men. So I thought, well, okay, I'm going to get bring those in. Now, these don't have a tag on them to tell what size they are. Uh, oh, the tag's on the bottom. Okay. Wow, that's a large. Holy cow. Oh, that's a pretty big large. That would be like a one, one X. Wow. So the sizing, sizing is pretty fair. Hmm, cool. All right. So those are the three t-shirts that I got in. And... What have we got in here? Oh, this is, hmm. this is, I got this for my car. Uh, where's my glasses? This might help if I have my eyeballs. Um, my car gets really dusty. So, I wanted to have something especially in the summertime when you have your window open and everything so i got a um fluffy cloth that i can you put your fingers hand and fingers through here um and you can just wipe off your your car so soft so i got that because i my car is a mess right now uh, oh these I got these. There's a couple of purses that I have in my shop um, that are like bigger purses. Problem with it is the sides flop over and there's no lining on the inside of it. So I got these to put inside. And there's snaps on the sides to open it up. And then it opens like that. And you can just drop it into your purse. And there's a whole bunch of pockets on the sides. 
on both sides. And then there's pockets on the inside, and it's got these handles so that you can just, you know, if you wanted to wash the inside of your purse or whatever, then everything's in here, and then you can just pull it out, uh, and and then you don't have to worry about every, anything falling out. So I did get a couple of these um, to put in there, but they're, like, sectioned off. Oops. See how they're sectioned off? So you've got, like little pockets and big some bigger pockets and then you got the two big pockets here so um so yeah i'm going to be putting those in um in those purses these are more shirts oh what else did i get oh here's the, whoops having an avalanche here's the other one that I'm going to be putting in the purse. Yes. Whoa! Okay, we're all falling over. We all fall down. Okay. See. Yeah, that's one of the squirrel shirts. Okay, and then I got some more of these shirts. I got quite a few shirts. And then I got, oh, I got these. These are t-shirt rulers for when I'm making um, baby sweaters and stuff like that. They are, they measure the, um, the yoke. And there's a few different sizes in here. If I could get it open, that would be great. Okay, fine. I'll use scissors then. There we go. So it comes, I think there's like four sizes. So it's an adult size, a youth size, a toddler size and an infant size and it measures out it oh, there we go I don't know if you can see that it measures out what the yoke is supposed to be um I thought this was brilliant because if you're crocheting your yoke you can just put this down on it and you can tell you can figure out how much of um <clears throat> of a uh size hole you need it tells you where the center is and so I thought that was pretty cool so I'm hoping that this is going to help me out when I'm making sweaters and even adult sweaters like when I'm making adult sweaters so okay let's see what we got in here oh I got some earrings and stuff to make earrings Oh, I got these. These are for your t-shirt. Or for any shirt, really. Oh, it's one of them. So, oh, let's see if I can do this. So when you got your shirt, if your shirt's too long or too, too long or too big, you take the tail and you put it through the top of this, and then you put it through the bottom. So you pull it, pull it through, and then you put it through the bottom. <sighs> like that. And then it just tightens it up, or it gives it a little bit of, um, a little bit of, uh, you know, what do you call it? Design or whatever. My sister, when <clears throat> when I was getting married, um, the lady that got gave, that we bought our uh, clothes from, she used one of these on my sister's shirt, <clears throat> and I tell you, it looked fantastic on my sister. It just slimmed her right out. Um, we were actually quite shocked. So I got that one, and then I got. This one. Oh, 
So you put your shirt through here and then through here. Oh, through the back anyway, through the back and then down through here. <coughs> so I thought that was pretty. Uh, what else did I get? This is me getting kind of lazy. I got some earrings. Ugh, if I can open them. I'm selling earrings so fast. I make all my earrings and I'm selling them so fast that I can't keep up because I'm doing um, $10 each or buy two, get one free. So I decided to bring a few in just to, you know, uh, just so I can, have, you know, have some time to make some. But these I thought were adorable when I bought them. I'm going to give a pair of these to my daughter, I think, because she's, oops, she loves giraffes. Uh, can you see that? It's a baby giraffe and a, ma a mama giraffe. I'll um I'll take the, a picture of them and uh, I'll put it up here. They are so cute. Oh, they're adorable. So I got those, and I got some with. The Tree of Life. The Tree of Life always seems to be very popular. And. <laughs> Again, itch. Um, that's not a Tree of Life. That's another giraffe. Uh, that's another giraffe. Tree of life. Oh, these were cool. Okay. I hope this isn't too loud in the mic. That was really pretty. So, uh, well, these are cute too. When I got these, I, I was thinking about my sister, me and my sister. Yeah, so. they're, they're on a swing set. <clears throat> Like I said, say, I'll take pictures of these and put them up because my camera doesn't seem to want to focus in. My camera is bad for that. So. Uh, these are pretty. Oh, these are the kitty cats. Oh. Those are cute. <laughs> yeah, I like those. Uh, then I got some boho style ones. Oh, they're in a separate bag. Okay, then. I gotta admit, they package their stuff pretty well. Oh, these are the dragon ones. Oops. You see the dragon? Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> that is really neat. I have a feeling that Georgia's dragon team is going to want those. I think I only brought in one pair. 
So I wanted to see what they looked like. Uh, oh, I brought in a few of these. Only because I am not really wonderful at doing wire wrapping. So. Oh. Oops. They're kind of wire wrapped. And a tiger, a cat's eye. And I think I've got these in a couple of colors. Uh, let's go with the cat. Oh my goodness. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> I'm just gonna grab them as I as I get them. Not <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> They're not in any particular order. This is another t-shirt um, pin. Little pearls. Oh, these were really cute too. Oh. oh, these are really pretty. They're cats, but you can see, whoops. They're glass, like in, encased in glass. Those are really pretty. I have a feeling those are going to sell really fast. I got a couple of those. Oh, and then I got, um, because we're in... Canada and BC, we get a lot of whales here. So I bought, oops, some whale tails. And I'm going to be making earrings out of those. <clears throat> those are really cute. And so I think I got a 20 pack of those. And then I got these whale tails. Well, these are cute, too. These are more for necklaces, but I might be able to get away with making earrings out of them. They're just on the cusp. They might be too heavy, but I don't know. We'll see. Maybe, maybe not. Oh. And then I got, this is another t-shirt heart, but in silver. They're really pretty. Uh, that's, a, uh, that's another t-shirt thing. I think we're coming down to the wire here, guys. Uh, here's another of the wire wrapped, but in like a opal-y color. Oh, I got, I did get some more whale tails. Okay, I got another wire, wire wrapped in purple. Yeah, these are all different, um, whoops, I'm losing my stuff here. Um, these are all of, of the same, same as the other ones. And then these ones are, I thought these were going to be bigger, but they're pretty anyway. Oh, we 
Can you see that? There we go. So those are cute. And last but not least, oops, was something I got for me because of you guys. Um, because my channel ooh, is heavy. Because my channel is bee related. <laughs> Because you guys are my yarn bees, and um, you guys have sent me lots of bee things. I got myself, oops, a bee ring. Isn't that pretty? It's really thick. But it's the bee. Now let's hope that it fits because I've actually um oh no oh no I uh my knuckles have gotten are swelling so yeah mm. I used to be, okay, my ring fingers, these fingers were usually a four or five, like really small. So I figured that my index fingers were about a six. Because my knuckles are growing from arthritis, it doesn't fit. So that really sucks because it's a really cool ring. I love it. So I'm going to have to order another one. I'm going to have to get a seven. Possibly an eight. Oh, what a bummer. What a bummer. See, on these fingers, it's too big. And on these fingers, it's too small. But it's a really nice ring. I really like it. Well, I guess it's one more thing I'm going to be able to sell in my shop. <laughs> that sucks. Ooh. Oh, well. Live and learn. But it's a really heavy-duty ring. It's sterling silver. So that's it, guys. That's everything I got. Um, I'm really impressed. I'm impressed with what I got. So, you know, you never know when you order from these companies, like, what you're actually getting. But I've had pretty good luck so far with this stuff. And uh, I'm pretty happy. Pretty happy. Oh, but I can't wait to get these shirts in the shop. Um, I think, excuse me, I think that they're going to sell really well. And uh, it came pretty fast. You know, I, I'm really impressed. It was less than a week. So, yeah. Yay! Okay, guys. Um, that's it. <laughs> that's it. I got to go and pack this up and get it ready for tomorrow. And I got to go and order myself another ring. <laughs> Who knew? Ugh. Oh, man, I guess I should have measured my fingers before I ordered it. But I always thought I knew what size my fingers were. But not anymore now that I've got arthritis. Yay. Okay, guys. So I will talk to you guys later. Thanks for joining me. And I will talk to you soon. Okay. Bye. And I buried my remote. <laughs> Old school.